Something big is brewing inside Samsung software labs. And this time, it's not just a patch or bug fix. It's the kind of update that could change how Galaxy phones feel to use. Hidden deep inside test builds and code names, One UI 8.5 is shaping up to be the smartest, most polished version of Samsung's interface yet. And yes, it's built directly on Android 16 2 pr 2 the version Google uses to roll out its most exclusive Pixel features. But Samsung, they're not just borrowing the code, they're rewriting the rulebook. Hey everyone, welcome back, Sam here. If you enjoy deep dives into Galaxy updates and hidden features before they go public, make sure to like this video, share it with your fellow Galaxy fans, and subscribe so you don't miss what's coming next. Trust me, One UI 8.5 is about to surprise even long-time Samsung users. Now here's where things get really interesting. This isn't your average mid-year update. Internally, it's a massive jump that even rivals some full number releases. Developers have confirmed that One UI 8.5 uses the new SDK 36.1, the same foundation behind Android 16 2 pr 2 but Samsung's version comes with its own AI-driven layer, deeper visual polish, and faster app responsiveness. Think of it like Android 16, reimagined the Galaxy way. Here's the kicker. While most Android brands skip QPR versions because they're complex and time-consuming, Samsung's decided to go all in. That means a wave of fresh refinements, smarter animations, and brand new interface behavior that could deboot months before Android 17 even arrives. If history repeats, this update will ship first with the Galaxy S26 lineup in early 2026, setting the tone for every Galaxy device update after that. But Samsung's not just chasing polish, they're chasing anticipation. One UI 8.5 is rumored to bring the next phase of Galaxy AI, smarter, more context aware, and more personal than before. You might start noticing your phone, predicting your next move even before you tap. AI, assisted shortcuts, adaptive app suggestions, and real time assistance baked across system menace could redefine how multitasking feels. One leaked feature that's caught everyone's attention is something insiders are calling touch assistant plus point. Think of it as a brain for your gestures, where your phone recognizes not just touches, but the intention behind them. You'll swipe, tap, or hold. And instead of rigid controls, it reacts dynamically, like it understands what you meant to do. Combine that with Samsung's rumored smart app resume, which lets you jump between tasks exactly where you left off, and suddenly multitasking becomes something fluid, not fragmented. Another area getting love is performance. Samsung's test engineers say One UI 8.5 is being optimized to reduce animation delay by up to 30%, especially in scrolling heavy apps like Instagram and Chrome. It's not just about speed. It's about making the phone feel effortless. Imagine unlocking your device, opening five apps, switching between two, and never once seeing a stutter. That's the kind of smoothness Samsung's aiming for here. Visually, early testers mentioned brighter iconography, refined shadows, and dynamic motion layers that adjust tone and blur depth in real time. Samsung wants your phone to feel alive, like the UI breathes with you. Even small touches like the way widgets refresh or notifications slide down are reportedly being rebuilt from the ground up. And here's a small but exciting twist. The lock screen might finally become a lot smarter. Samsung's experimenting with Live Briefs, an evolved version of Now Briefs that displays your personalized schedule, health stats, weather, and AI generated daily highlights every time you wake your phone. It's part of Samsung's push to make Galaxy AI not just a background tool, but something you actually see and feel every day. Then there's sharing. The humble quick share feature is getting a massive brain boost. Soon, it may automatically detect nearby devices, prioritize frequently connected ones, and even predict when you're about to send something, offering one tap shortcuts before you do it. Samsung is also reportedly working on deeper cross device continuity. So your Galaxy phone tab and watch talk to each other seamlessly under the same Galaxy AI framework. But hold on, not every Galaxy device will make the cut. Based on Samsung's usual software roadmap, we're expecting One UI 8.5 to hit the Galaxy S26 lineup first, followed by the S25 and Z Fold 6 series, and then trickle down to select A series models. Older devices like the S22 and Fold 4 might not be so lucky this time. That's the trade, off of building something this complex. The system demands newer hardware for the AI-driven upgrades to truly shine. Now here's where things start to get spicy. If Samsung's internal schedule holds, we might see the first closed beta builds of One UI 8.5 around late December 2025, right before the S26 reveal, 
That means early testers could be running Android 16 Chew PR2 with Samsung's interface long before Google releases its own feature drop for Pixel users. Basically, Samsung could beat Google at its own game. And that's not all. Developers digging through test code have spotted references to a revamped smart wallpaper engine. This system seems to let your wallpaper react dynamically to time, notifications, or even charging status. For example, your wallpaper might glow softly while charging or subtly darken when your phone enters sleep mode. Small details, but they make your device feel more like a living companion than a static screen. Even the camera apps getting new tricks. Samsung's experimenting with faster post processing using AI assisted scene detection, where the phone can recognize objects, lighting, and faces faster than ever and apply optimized filters instantly. Early reports suggest an 18% faster shutter response compared to One UI 8, which is a big leap for mobile photography fans. The secret weapon, though, is integration. Samsung wants every bit of One UI 8.5, from multitasking to file management, to feel unified by AI. For example, imagine copying a number from a message, switching to notes, and your phone automatically suggesting a title and context for that note, knowing what it's about. That's the level of contextual awareness Samsung's testing right now. So, is One UI 8.5 worth waiting for? Absolutely, but it's more than that. It's Samsung's way of signaling the future AI at the center, design that adapts, and performance that anticipates. Sure, not every feature will make it to the final release. Some might stay hidden in beta builds, but the direction is clear. One UI 8.5 isn't just an update, it's a preview of Samsung's next chapter. And as we count down to the Galaxy S26 launch, the real question is, can any other Android brand keep up? Because if even half these features make it to the final build, One UI 8.5 might just redefine how Android should feel in 2026. So Galaxy fans, buckle up. The software revolution is coming, and it's starting right inside your pocket.